This is where I talk to myself. Oh, I got a thumbs up. That's doing something right. Okay. Hey, Danielle. Hi, Veronica. Hey, Jeffrey. I know I've been I've been good about this uh, pretty much every day this week. It's it's been an exciting week. Hey, Shane. Hey, Paulo. Hey, Hannah. Oh, you're sweet. So guys, um, yeah, this is kind of a special day. Hi, Christina. Uh, we just filmed a new postmodern jukebox video uh, with a very talented singer and clarinetist, and she happens to be here right here. This is Chloe. <laughs> Chloe Fiorenzo. 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 Oh, it was close, right? I was close, very close. I was saying it sounds like, a, like an Italian opera or something like that. It's a very fancy name. Kind of. So, um, so Chloe just made her postmodern jukebox debut. Uh, although you guys haven't seen it yet, because we just literally five minutes before just we it. just finished recording <laughs> just it. Just finished it. Yeah, and it's so much fun, and it's really exciting. Yeah. So I thought I'd uh, introduce you guys to Chloe, so you can kind of <laughs> learn more about her. Yeah. Chloe is from. You're from New Orleans. I live in New Orleans. You, I'm you're, from California. Got it. Originally, New Orleans. Yes. Yeah, and which is um, and when you hear her play, you'll understand why she lives in New Orleans. <laughs> like you, you have that sound, mm -hmm. which is so amazing. I've done a lot of traditional jazz throughout my life. So. Yeah, so, so Chloe is just a phenomenal uh, clarinetist and singer, and uh, yeah, oh, people are saying hi to you. Alex hi, says hi. Guys, hello. Yeah. <laughs> so why don't we just like, uh, cut to it, and let's play a song. Yeah. And um, you know, we were talking about After You've Gone, which is mm -hmm. a, a quintessential jazz standard. Like, mm -hmm. I actually, I recorded it in Bioshock Infinite. That was like Ooh. the title music back in the day. So, so I, I, I learned it, I think, uh, I, I knew it a little bit before, but mm -hmm. I got to really know it because yeah. of that. <laughs> yeah. So I'm yeah. going to try to keep up with you, okay? <laughs> Maybe we'll start it with, all right, here we go. We're going to try to rig this so we can see both of us. And, nope. Almost. All right, so we're going to do a little after you've gone. And, uh, almost Ooh, there. Almost, almost there. there. Okay, almost you know there. what I'm going to do? Take a step <laughs> back there. All right, how about that? Closer? I don't know. Safety. That's good enough. Yeah. Good enough, okay. enough for jazz, right? Good enough for jazz. All right, so maybe we'll start. You take the melody on clarinet and then maybe do a little singing. We'll figure it out. One, two, one, two. Thank you. 
costumes are usually me just butchering people's names. It's just a lot of that. So this is Chloe cool. Fioranzo. Wow, an amazing clarinetist. Thanks, just Scott. filmed her very first postmodern jukebox video with us today, mm -hmm. and um, I tagged her in this this post. So if you if you enjoy this music and everything like that, go follow Chloe. Check out what she's got. You got lots of videos on YouTube. Lots you got, of videos. Yeah, lots yeah. Of, and I do a lot of live videos as well from concerts. Awesome, so. awesome. So now, how did you get into like this kind of music? I'm going to pull this closer yeah. so we can read all the nice comments. I'm seeing hearts. I'm seeing, you know. <laughs> um, fantastic. I, Thank you. Bravo. All right. <laughs> Yay. Thank Lots you, guys. So how did you um, get into... Um, so I first heard this, like, some of the style of music. My parents used to take swing dance lessons when I was in elementary school. Nice. And I fell in love with swing dancing. Um, but I first heard decently in jazz and traditional jazz for the first time when I was 13 years old at the San Diego Thanksgiving Festival. And they have one every year, and I've gone every year since nice. then. Nice. Oh, that's um, amazing. It's a tradition. It's so infectious, and I fell in love with it, and I couldn't, haven't gone back. That's amazing. Well, that was like for the same thing for me. Um, I came into discovering jazz when I was like about 12 or 13, oh, and that was through Rhapsody in Blue was the first song oh, I heard. So I, right. which has an awesome clarinet, clarinet part. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's pretty serious. Uh, and... Yeah, so it was the same thing for me. I kind of came to it around the same time. I don't know why that is. It's like a magic age. You're 13. It is. I mean, you know, discover tried yeah, jazz. Yeah, you're discovering things. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I'm reading some comments here. Hi from Grand Rapids. Nice. Oh. Incredible. I got so many hearts from Jocelyn. She sent so <laughs> many hearts. So hearts. much love. And yeah. <laughs> Thank you. All. That's great. And it uh, makes me miss playing oh, oboe. Jazz. Oboe. Do you play any? Do you play any jazz oboe? I don't play oboe. Yeah. You do saxophone. I, I do saxophone. I do. Yeah. The reeds, but I don't do, oh, not the double reeds, just the double reeds. reeds. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> that's something else, yeah. Um, Jonathan says flowers, I guess she's, he's commenting on your, yeah. your hair, you got a flower in the hair. Yeah, there you go. That's a, so do Rhapsody in Blue, oh jeez, oh, um, I don't even, I'm not that's sure a long that's song, that's, a, <laughs> that's seven a minutes, song. I don't know if we have seven I minutes to do that stuff. I swoop, but, <laughs> but not, yeah, I'll do a little swoop if you want. How about we do a little swoop, just I show can... them at the beginning, because that's like, yeah. I, I uh, I'm just yeah, uh, okay. That's it. That's good enough. <laughs> like yeah, that? that's amazing. That's, that sounds great. <laughs> awesome. All right. So why don't we take a request from from the people? We're gonna, oh. we're gonna take one from the people. Okay. And let's see what play some get, Benny Goodman or Freebird. Those are two very oh, different things. That's very different. Yeah. Do you know Rose Room? Rose Room. I don't. Or, uh, which one is that? Um, is that the one that's um? Is it basically? In a melotone, it's the same yeah, chords. Yeah, it's pretty much yeah. the same thing. Um, okay. Well, let's we see what do... people... I, I, we got one from um, Smile. I guess Smile. Wiggle on the good notes. I don't know. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> we won't even touch that one. I don't even know. Um, smile, do you know Charlie Chaplin? No. Oh, I have a good Or St. James one Infirmary. I oh, we can always do that, yeah. That's a good, that's a good one, too. That's a good one. Yeah. Oh, and of course, the Saints. Hey, Jude. Hey, Jude. The Beatles. <laughs> hey. Dude, shake it off. Could you oh. play? Could you play uh, "Hey Jude" on clarinet? If we do like a try. jazz version, I can try. Why don't we try this? We've never tried this before. Okay, so there's a request for "Hey Jude." Please excuse any of my mistakes. <laughs> so we're gonna just try this. This is what I do. We kind of uh, um, just you know throw you into the fire. Awesome. And we're just gonna Sounds try something. Great. Okay, so this is "Hey Jude." We're gonna do kind of a bluesy, bluesy New Orleans take on "Hey Jude." Okay.
was actually amazing. <laughs> Chloe Fioranzo, we've never done that before. That was Hey Jude, kind of a New Orleans version. That's never like a future that before. Right we've never, that's just, you're just witnessing uh, creativity right here. So guys, this is Chloe. I just tagged her in the post. You can follow her. She just made her postmodern jukebox debut today. Uh, we just filmed her, her first video, and really it came excited. out really awesome. Yes. Uh, we're all very excited about it, and you can see that she's just a phenomenal talent. Thank so you. Thank you for having me. Amazing, really, amazing. I really appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. and um, I'll, let you, I'll let people talk to you a little bit oh. just to say. You oh, can read some please, come marching. Okay, there's, there's, there's right, come on. <laughs> um, lots of thank yay, you. woo. I appreciate it. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. Hello, Cliff and Martin and Jason. And Shauna. They come so fast, don't they? It's like they just get scrolls it's up. Kind of like fast, seeing yeah. little hearts and things go across the screen. Chris is giving you a standing ovation. Oh, yay! Thank you, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. So, um, guys, uh, thanks for tuning in. Uh, so, Postmodern Treatbox, you know kind of what we do. If you're watching for the first time, hello. Check out Postmodern Treatbox. And uh, uh, one of the great things about this platform that we have is we get to bring in talent from all over the world and bring in phenomenal musicians and have them, you know, kind of come into our world and do their thing. And Chloe's uh, the latest that we're bringing into our world. And um, she's just, you know, stunning. She's going to stun everybody with her talent. So. <laughs> you really made it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, maybe we'll end with Saints Go Marching In. Sure. Just for <laughs> the hundred people that requested it. <laughs> yes. And we'll do this really quick. Okay. Saints go marching in. Uh, I'll let you start. You good. That's it. Yeah, no, but uh.
Joey Fioranza, thank you everybody. Thanks for watching. Everybody have a great night, okay? Mm -hmm. have a good All night. right. Bye, Facebook. See ya.